Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. All right, guys, let's just dig in and see what is going on. Don't forget to flip these energies, guys. It may or may not resonate, right? Don't make it yours if it's not yours. Apply where necessary, right? Flip these energy, guys, right? And learn learn from a lesson learn from a relationship relationships that don't work is growth right you should, uh, we may not be happy about it but it's still growth it's a learning curve it's we learn about what not to do we learn about not jumping into relationships so fast we learn not to fall for the okie doke we learn that we realize oh I thought I loved this person and I didn't it's it's learning right and it's growth you can't stay in one spot in life right if you're lucky enough to meet the one you're going to meet the one but guess what even when you meet the one it's not always going to be sunshine and roses it's not you're going to have ups and downs you're going to have bad days good days days you don't talk days you do talk day when somebody falls short when you fall short when they fall short when somebody lies no relationship and especially if they've been together for 20 30 40 50 60 years you can't tell me that it's always been butterflies. It has not. They just found ways to work around it, right? Sometimes you could be with your child's father or your child's mother. You may break up and get back together when the child is 15. God only knows, right? Nobody can control it. It happens, right? Some people say you shouldn't be with that person. Some people say you should. It doesn't matter. What it's meant to be will be. We can try to control it, but we can't control it. Everything is not going to be perfect. And then sometimes there will be those relationships where you'd be like, oh my God, I will never do that again, right? That's a learning lesson. Learn a lesson. Learn a lesson, right? Learn a lesson. That's all it is. That that's that's called maturity. It's called growth. It's called knowing when you fell short, knowing when you picked the wrong person, knowing when you left somebody and you know you should have stayed with them. It's it's a learning knowing that you shouldn't have had a baby with this person or blah 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 or even married that person. It's it's learning. It's called life. No one has just like there's not a rule book on parenting. It's just figuring it out and doing the right thing and taking care of a child. It's the same thing with love. There is not one book on love that would be the same for everybody. It's not. It's different. Some people's book read A through Z, 1 through 10. Others is like 1, 5, 7, 3, 2, 8, 9, X, Y, P, Q, R, B, C, F. You know what I mean? It is what it is. So get in where you fit in, guys. Holy Spirit, what's going on? And don't claim everything. It says, I don't know what to say. But if it resonates with you, then it resonates, period. Mary had a little lamb, okay? Holy <laughs> Spirit. Your body language says so much. They don't know what to say. Maybe you're giving off of an energy of don't even think about it. Don't talk to me. Your body language could be saying that I'm angry. Your body language could be saying, I, you know, it says a lot of things. But whoever this person is, they don't know what to say to you. They know that they were careless with you. I was careless with you. Um, and, and you know what that means. You know what they did or didn't do, right? And they said, we are more alike than I like to admit. So, you do have things in common with this person. You're very similar in some ways. Um, but they really don't know what to say to you right now. Your body language could be given off of this, don't even talk to me type energy. Alright guys, what is going on here in your collection? Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Your body language. If this is you, if you're the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, you could be angry. And they may not know what to say to you. You're just in your space. They are trying to follow their intuition, though, when it comes to you. They're definitely trying to read your body language. Trying to figure it out. They was careless with you when they weren't offering you this love, Page of Cups in Reverse, when they just wasn't offering you the love or giving you the love you deserve or making the love offer. 
um, betrayal. So I don't know if you betrayed them and they betrayed you because they said we're more alike than I like to admit. So maybe they betrayed you and then you did one back or vice versa. But there was definitely betrayal between the both of you, possibly. For some of you, it could have just been them or just you. They are very frustrated, though, because they don't know what to say. So it's almost like they're holding on to things. They don't know what to say. They see you as being single and abundant. Maybe you checked out of this relationship here. And you're just single and just living your best life. So now they probably don't even know how to approach you anymore. And they're not in hangman on when they was careless with you. Like they know what they did. They know what they did wrong. It's like they know what they they know where they went wrong with you. And they're not up in their head. They figure you two have something in common. I don't know if it was betrayal or maybe they feel like they betrayed you and then you just moved on. So now they feel betrayed. Um, Page of Pentacles in reverse. They definitely don't know what to say to you. They don't even know how to come to you right now. They know things were unbalanced and that they were uh, given to other people. Yeah, they were out there. Knight of Wands in reverse. They was careless with you. Uh, Page of Cups in reverse. Knight of Wands in reverse. So they were busy. And... They're not making the love offer or they didn't make you this love offer. Two of Cups in reverse or you decline their love offer, you know. So they betrayed you and then you stopped accepting their cup. So basically, you probably didn't betray them, but you just basically said you're not going to deal with it, right? They can see that you moved on with this uh, Two of Wands in Reverse energy. Like you moved on. They don't know what to say. Because um, they were being very sneaky. So they don't know what to say to you right now. They are frustrated though. Queen of Swords in Reverse. They feel that you're angry. That you're angry. That's your body language. And that you're holding your energy back. Like you're not giving them attention or the time that you used to possibly. It's like you just kind of moved on. Yeah, you're the Empress. They don't know how to approach you. They're scared. They don't even know how to approach you right now. Um, Page of Cups in reverse. And they're looking back at what they did. They know they was careless with you. So they're looking back. They know they didn't offer you the love. Uh, that you deserve, you know, or even just made their gesture. But you do make them happy or you did make them happy. They could have took advantage of your kindness as well. Five of Swords. So after they betrayed you, you just kind of changed on them. You changed. And things ended. Ten of Swords. So they're still on a karmic wheel. You're single, you're abundant. Or maybe you realized this was a karmic wheel and you got off. For some of you, you probably found out that this person was married or in another connection. And that's one of the reasons why I was unbalanced. They had other lovers. They had a choice between lovers here. So they was definitely given to other people. But they're saying that you're their emotional fulfillment. So they definitely regret what they did. That's for sure. Looks like they know what they did wrong. They're not a hangman anymore. They know that's why you're not accepting their cup or giving them that time anymore. Knight of Wands in reverse. It's a King of Cups. It looks like they want to offer you love. They don't know how. They want to come towards you. They probably don't know how. And they don't think you're going to accept their cup if they offer it to you again. Two of Cups in reverse. Knight of Pentacles. They may try to come in though, guys. Moving in slowly with this Page of Pentacles here. Taking their time. They may try to come back. 
but they're not very helpful. They're not very helpful. You ended things with them. You changed. I think once you found out about a betrayal or something, it could have been a possible family. They weren't standing in their power, anything like that. Holy Spirit, clarify. I don't know what to say. High priestess in reverse. They're not following their intuition. They don't know what to say to you at all. They don't think they're going to get a new beginning. That's one reason why. They're scared to reapproach you. They know they was careless with you. So I think now they're kind of feeling the guilt or feeling bad because of what they didn't do when they had the chance. But I also feel like they're missing you and they want to come and talk to you, but they are afraid because of your body language. You're giving off a don't even try it because you pretty much it looks like you moved on. So they don't even know how to approach you anymore. But they may. They're just not very hopeful. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.